the ball. Yes, sir. That's our new theme. Bows. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk, we gonna have fun. <laughs> we be on fire, we be lit, lit. lit. It's a unique hustle, big, big, big shit. Hey. Big shit, big shit, big shit. Huh. It's a unique hustle, nigga, big shit. <laughs> big shit, big shit, big shit. Huh. Name another podcast like this. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO, and I'm here with the official, lovely... Miss Jamaica. Well, go on. You done know my damn Hey, man. So today, man, is special. Real special, man. I'm having a good time, man. It's been a good day. Very. But, but it's getting better every every minute, man. So the guy that I've been talking about the most on my show, he's here, man. And I had to make sure my camera's right. This dude know a little more than most <laughs> of the other ones. You know what I'm saying? So check it out, man. Half Pine is here, man. How you doing, brother? I'm doing great, man. Man, I can tell you, man, I've been sitting here waiting on this. I had Pusher, man. I mm -hmm. had Lil Ronnie, and uh, who else did we have? Oh, the Peace, because he be hanging out with y'all yep. a little bit. Yep. I said, man, I got to get Half Pint. I even asked Lil Ronnie, I said, man, what's up with Half Pint? He said, that's my little dude, man, but you bigger than him, so I don't even know what that was all about. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's big bro. <laughs> he was like, that's my dude. I was like, yeah, man, I got to get that dude on the show. It's going to happen. We're going to get all the top off in here. That's what he said, but y'all need more microphones. Oh, I told that nigga we can buy more microphones, nigga. You don't know who you talking to. I'm a hustler. Nah, for sure. <laughs> so how, how's everything going, man? Going great. So how did you end up being from Fort Worth and then coming and really, really permeating all of the streets, man, and not just in Dallas because you done did things outside of Dallas. Yeah. How did you get into this whole thing, man? Uh, well, I started off in Fort Worth, but... I kind of my business kind of grew into Dallas because I was hanging with Lorenny and Papa Run and people like them from Dallas when I first started. So that's how I kind of grabbed the whole city at once type shit. The the thing that I looked at was I'm like, man, this dude not only because when you're dealing with these artists, man, these artists really start to get grounded when they're dealing with you, and that's been the most exciting thing to watch. I want to tell you thank you. Like, ain't that something I do? Mm -hmm. Got to say thank you because you, Appreciate I enjoyed that. the whole movement, yeah. and I'm real nosy, and I'm in the music a lot, <laughs> and I'm old. I don't even probably be looking at some of this stuff. <laughs> You know what I'm talking about, but I said, "Dang, man!" I say, "Man, this this dude really rocking the you know the city, man." Because yeah. we need that. A lot of times, you know, without you, you know, people from the outside gonna get that money. Mm -hmm. I'm being real. People nah, on the outside sure. gonna get that look. Yep. And, and 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 you I, did you was you just talented from the jump with these cameras? No, Hell you was no. trash. I was trash. I still <laughs> feel like I'm trash today compared to some of the people. Other people, but well, it's some competition out here. Oh yeah, for sure. Oh, it's because he's always looking to improve, so he's always looking at the ones who are way better, and me like look at his and like crit criticizing yourself. See, yeah. see, not no more. Now I'm, I'm fine with where I'm at now with my videography. I just if somebody better than me, I hire them to shoot. <laughs> that makes sense. I'm Before, the same yeah. way. Like the yard and all that stuff around the house. Yeah, uh, if somebody better than me, I'm like half paint. I'm hiring them. I'm <laughs> I ain't got time so, to be trying to compete no more. I, when Lil Ronnie was here, he told me y'all did the deal dedicating it to the guy who pretty much started top off. What was his name? Mm -hmm. JT? JT, yeah. Yeah. JT, the big, not the bigger figure. It's just JT. JT, Mr. Guaranteed Mr. Direct. That's him, the one yeah. that was dancing on that video I seen. Mm hmm Yeah, so so you knew him. You was in this whole family when it first took off. Well, no, I was... Actually, top off started in 2008. Eight, yeah. Yeah, I didn't get in top off until 2011. And I actually really? never got a chance to like meet JT like in person. We was always on the phone. On the phone. But like a month, not even it wasn't even a whole month after he put me in top off, he passed away. So wow, yeah. So that's that's deep. I that never make even you, got to meet him. That make you have to push harder too because you know what it meant. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it kind of left something on your back mm -hmm. to say, kind of like what Sir Charles say, BB King kind of. You know, nah, when he, he had, he had a solid foundation already going on. For yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. The culture, man, for the culture, man. That's what people been telling me, man. I did the podcast really for the store. But my partner, D-Map, in Atlanta said, man, thank you, man. You're doing this for the culture. Said, no, nigga, I'm doing this for the store. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did this to try to make sure people start knowing about the store and where we at. But it turned into something bigger than what I even was even thinking about. Yeah. That's crazy, man. It'd be like that. I was, Right? That's true. Because I was like, I'm just going to talk to a few people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now it turned to a lot more than a few people. 
It's a good I, setup. I had a it's guy a come setup. from North Carolina. Thank you. Uh, flew in. Flew in. I, was, I was like, dang. Then another dude come from Oakland, California. Then another one. Where did he come from? It was one more that came from out of town, Mississippi. Yeah. I'm like, dang. They like, I just like the way it looked. We want to be on there. I'm like, damn. I, I guess we're doing all right. Mm -hmm. And 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 so we we knew, but we got the right people on here. Yeah. See, I know, I, and we picking why. It's, I ain't gonna say no name. You know, I'm a little messy though. Nigga, come at me wrong. I gotta get him, but I'm gonna mm -hmm. let him make it. <laughs> nigga, try to pay like I want want you to pay me to be on your. I said, nigga, I didn't even want you. Another nigga called me and told me the nigga said this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, nigga, I don't even do. It. We really not about none of that beef, none of that. We straight yeah. just it's yeah. love. Yeah. So it's a whole different. You can't even come on here and really be beefing. Mm -hmm. This is straight love for it's the family. city. It's family, and we grown. You know what I'm saying? We want to see things come together, not torn apart, bro. Yeah. And that's sure. what I that's what I always represented. So it's easy for me to be me and sitting over here, you know. Yeah. But at any rate, man, I always be asking questions about you. But I'm gonna let my wife start because because she uh got a list over there, and I know she do. And then she's gonna be like, I didn't get to say my questions. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to it. <laughs> Had, um, the name Half Pint, did you have that name before Top Off? Oh, yeah. I was born with that name. My daddy named me that when I was born. Why? Because I was small. I came out a small baby. I was a small child. All How the many way pounds up until. How many pounds? Was? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You was five pounds, was, four I, ounces? <laughs> nigga, you were two <laughs> pounds? I have, no, I have no idea. I just know I was small all the way up until like 11th grade, probably 12th grade or something like that. I outgrew my name, but. You still kept it. I'm still, yeah, I'm still Half Pint. Cause when I Google half pint, do you know there's a half pint in Jamaica? Oh, here we go. I should have knew it. Yeah, every song it we took, yeah. everything we done, <laughs> they got to try to every race we ran. Uh -huh, uh -huh. My wife. Don't start with this now. Where did rap start? Oh, here we go. I'm not going to do it. Man, we're not going to embarrass ourselves in front of half pint like this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all did a little thing, but it wasn't rap. It was That's something true like though, but Thank when you. I when I first started searching up my name, typing mm -hmm. in half pint, it came in Jamaica. In Jamaica oh, yeah. guess what? She gonna let you know. Most that. definitely, you don't have to worry about that part, sir. It definitely came She's up. She's definitely gonna tell you about. <laughs> it. <laughs> they don't play about their stuff. They oh, feel yeah. like it's straight small, but they really, really serious about their look country or whatever oh, yes. island, you whatever that is. Oh yeah, I grew up around some Jamaicans too. You like you, oh, yeah. you like the food you love the good, culture. right? Oh yeah, yeah, it's, it's a nice. It's popping, ain't it? Oh, yeah. They ain't looking for no drama either until you want it. They'll, oh, bring, yeah. it They'll bring it to you. They'll bring it to you for sure. <laughs> oh, for sure. <laughs> and and the beats and the music is oh, awesome. Oh, here we go. You it's know, it's amazing. I agree. But some of it is okay, but some of it is a little tough on me. Uh, you got to be. I went to a strip club over there. I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> it's totally different than over here. Yeah, you, 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 you just got to see this half pint. I can imagine. Oh man, but it's, <laughs> oh, it's nice though. It got to be going it's on. It's throat, there. boy. Like you wouldn't even know. I can't even explain it. <laughs> I was over there with. She had me with Sean Paul's bodyguards. I felt like I was somebody. Yeah. Till the nigga told me kill twenty six people. I said I need to be going away from this. <laughs> <laughs> so, go ahead, babe. Um, as a child, what did you want to be when you got older? Oh, I most definitely thought I was going to the NBA. Oh, that, you could hoop? This nigga. No, my I son. Wasn't that good. Oh, my <laughs> son. This nigga. Boy, you made me think. I had flashbacks when you said we that. We all had hoop dreams, All these man. niggas think they going to the NFL, the NBA. I said, nigga, you need to get a job. You know? Yeah, that dream That dream was dead by middle school. I couldn't oh, pass by my classes. School. Yeah, I couldn't pass my classes. The pass, no pass, no play rule. Uh, fuck that yeah, all up for yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. So after that, what did you want to do or you just didn't think about it? I started, well, after that, I didn't know what I wanted to do, but I started doing videography in ninth grade, so it didn't take me too long. to. At, once I started doing videography, you I knew it. that is what I was going to be doing. Awesome, awesome. Do you remember the first video that you did? Yep. Nope. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, the first video I did was uh, it was with Mike Fresh, and he's still with us today on the top off. Awesome. So he got on top off after you or before you? Um. Well, he just got with. He been with us since day one, but he really just came became officially top off like last year because okay. we we had other dealings going on. We had some other deals with other labels and stuff like that. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I I think you know the thing you got to realize is man you y'all building an arsenal over there. You know, I like I told the run it wasn't no way. Y'all supposed to came up together like y'all did and then made the foundation like y'all did. That's only about God, just to be honest. It'll be you. going on. Yeah, yeah. Like for the, the, all like that, that stuff to link the way it did, you know. And I I mean, we've had 
questions about Erica Banks on here. We had questions about, I wasn't really worried about Erica. I've been talking about Yella and you. That's what I've been talking about. I've been trying to figure out this nigga started out. Boy, I tell you, it was, it was half paint, everything. I mm -hmm. said, boy, we headed somewhere. I ain't going to lie. But then all of a sudden when it pit, when it got to where it was going to break, this nigga broke loose. And I'm trying to figure out how why y'all ain't work together ever again, ever in life. I ain't even seen you on a picture together, man. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Talk nah, to that, me. That came about really... It was really started with his label saying Y'all can't take pictures pictures together? No. Nah. Yeah, yeah, nigga, that's what I'm nah, talking about. I still talk to y'all all the time. Okay, well give me the goods. But on we it. just don't shoot together or nothing because it started with his label saying basically like my video's not up to par, like okay. the quality that they want. But I'm like, Y'all signed him off my videos, so exactly. how the fuck are they not up to par? It, it, but right. I, I said this to Lil Ronnie and I, I say it again. I stand behind what I say. I feel like Yella, if he the way his stuff started doing, it should have been a movement where y'all work so much together, y'all should have collabed some kind of way to make that happen. It, yeah. It's supposed, it's supposed to happen. It was supposed to happen. I mean, I'm way. stomped down. So whoever, my cats with me, been with me for years, I take them everywhere with me. I don't care who come. You you sign paperwork, nigga, you got to rock with him too. It don't matter because of the way it was. I, mean, I just don't think it's, I think you do a lot of stuff for people, and I don't think you get the just credit. I definitely don't. I'm you're being right. real. You're absolutely And right. I don't like it because I'm real hardcore. You know, I'm I don't like school. it either. <laughs> I mean, I'm being like, like you help people even when it come down to, even Erica, I, she ain't been gone long. So I ain't going to be too hard on because because at the end of the day, some still could evolve into something else. I don't want to, mm -hmm. but I am saying that the work you put in with these artists and then they just, you know, all of a sudden they just gone. I don't get that. Me either. Is That's it something you're doing though. to them? This is what I thought about at my house. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> I say, this nigga must be really, you know, how a woman be being battered or something, and then, you know, she finally get out the damn house. <laughs> I said, was he hard on him or something when he was working together? But Lil Ronnie, like, that's my dog. He don't, you know, he good people. So I, I kind of was like, okay, Lil Ronnie say he good. He must be all right. Did he folks just, what's you going on? Anybody that done been with me and left me, they going to tell you I'm a good nigga. I think anybody. I heard an Asian doll or somebody say they would always work with you. Somebody I heard say something like that. I don't know. I've been knowing Asian doll since I think before was she was her. a rapper too. So. Yeah, yeah, I'll always do whatever you know he need me to do. Oh, no, so that was... Uh, it was somebody. Enchanting. And that's it. You that got was Enchanting, it. yeah. Enchanting. I started with you her You remember too. that? Yep. I heard it. I was like, oh, that's good. At least she said it. I'm listening because I don't want to be the wrong type oh, yeah. of... No, nah, that's my sister. I don't want to be behind sure. this mic saying something that ain't really real. You know what I'm saying? Know, so, what's up with the cameras? I mean, because I did first start feeling like, okay, okay, why not buy the camera? Because you got money. And I know you got money. I've been watching everything. Of course. Okay, so why don't you, do you not like? Oh, no, I could buy the camera myself. Or, or you sure. could rent the camera, whatever. So why why didn't you take that route to be? Because I'm not finna go buy a camera because a nigga need me to have the camera when you're getting the money. I'm not getting the money. That's right. So That's you right. should buy the camera. Yeah, make it make sense to me. Fight. I'm Give doing it to just me. fine with what I got. I'm <laughs> not finna go. Sense. Matter of fact, I did buy a camera. Okay. That was... Higher standard. price, yeah, 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 and industry standard, exactly, and didn't get no money back for it, and, and still didn't get the look, didn't get the look. So, I get it, I get it, but I already kind of figured that. But I, I just been want, had a red I just camera wanted there. it on my platform, you know, yep. be said because I know you didn't talked about it somewhat before, but I just don't Absolutely. like. I like it to be one hundred, man. Yeah, and like, like you do good work. So, I mean, at the end of the day, um, I don't know. I, I mean, is what's the standard? Uh, it, if I want to put some on Netflix, you have you checked in all this? What's the standard? Um, like a red cam and um, basically it's just like a quality standard. It really, it really is not no standards okay. no more to the to the game. It's really not no. Standards. You know, I'm asking because I don't know. Yeah, it's, <laughs> you got stuff on Netflix shot with goddamn with with these cameras. Really? It's, yes, you can put anything on there. It's it used to be TV got to be a certain quality and. It ain't, it's, they ain't going, it, it's whatever. Now. I know I, Sir Charles told me that. He said that a lot of B roll is, is stuff that they shoot with whatever. Yeah. He can mix it in and they don't even ever have but an he issue. He said with. you couldn't do it with the Canon and you can do it with these. But he you said you could do it with the, the, with the, the GH. With the, five. with the, with, with the Lumix. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? But, it, but and, the and, the, and that magic, that pocket Black magic. magic. Yeah, yes. he got those too. And he was like, you can do it with those, but certain ones they trip on. Yeah, I'd like, have had them all, but they don't really be tripping like that. You don't think if so? If you, if you got, if you, if you format your video right, it's 
that's all that matters at the end. Okay. Okay. Good. 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 Go ahead. I know you guys. So some. um, it's coming out. Hold on. <laughs> 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 no, with the videos, um, music videos. Do you have any aspirations in moving into movies? Film, short films, films, documentaries, documentaries, mm, stuff like that. Yeah, nigga, you can do it, nigga. We already know you got the talent. Oh yeah, I could do it, but like I said, I'm I'm really kind of moving out of the video lane. Period. What you gonna do? What are you? I'm on my I'm on my CEO. Problem. I'm I'm with you. I'm that's what my name. E CEO. Yeah. I'm with you. Yeah, man. I'm, I'm really on that. Goal? My two year goal. Yeah, let's start short first. I could really do goal. business with you because I don't I, think you're gonna screw me over. I done oh, nah. already check you out, nigga. You Never. done told it off on yourself. I rock with you. What we doing? What we doing? What we doing? What we I got a budget, <laughs> nigga. I got money. What's up? We can get it in. <laughs> Come to me with good ideas. What's, 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 what's your what's the what's some of Give us a little bit of it. I'm I really just I'm trying to pop my artists off. Okay. How many yeah. artists? All of them, but all, all of the is, ones on top one. of you trying to get all twenty eight of them, all thirty five of them, all eighty two of them, nigga. You got a lot all of them. Take is one. Once I get one else. gone, it's gonna be a. a Everybody's gonna. Mm. I like. We it. all gonna bust through the door. Okay, well, I got a question now. Since you said that, um, so I want to be your artist now. I'm uh, I'm twenty. Two twenty one. Mm-hmm. I want to be on top off. Uh, I'm working hard. I got visuals. Uh, yeah, I don't have a lot of followers because I'm new. Mm-hmm. Matter of fact, I'm 17, but mm-hmm. my mama say I can rap. You know what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. So how do I get? How do I impress a half pint? Man, I really, I really don't pay attention to clout or none of that. Every artist I've ever gotten, well, except Latuzzi. Every artist besides Latuzzi that I've ever got didn't have like a big following coming into the situation. I care about talent, like. What did Every you, artist I what got is talented. What did you see in Yellow that made you shoot him so dang much, man? His film. I mean, Yellow, that, that was what did that you ain't see? had nothing to do with no rap. That was my partner from just that's he was what just, I thought. We was just together every day. Yeah, that's, that's what my I brother. thought. We, it had nothing to do with no rap. When I met him, I didn't even know he was a rapper at first. Really. Yeah, and so then you, Papa Run sh- started showing me his music. Shout out Papa Run. We were just together the other day. That's a yeah. good dude. I like that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, it ain't had nothing to do with no rap at first. So you just was on the strip, but you knew it was talent. Oh yeah. And did you ever at early on feel like, dang man, this this thing gonna go? I mean, yeah, yeah. Anybody I deal with, like on that level, I feel like everybody around me, like from Yella, Lil Runny, I was with Go Yayo way yeah, before. Go he was, yeah, way before he, he was. He locked up right now. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Free Yayizzle, man. Free Yayizzle. Yeah, yeah. What is his name? Ye- yeah, say it yeah. again. I can't say that. You messed me up. <laughs> Yayizzle. Yeah, and my boy said Yayizzle. Yeah. Free Yayizzle, man. <laughs> and, uh, all these people was my friends and bros before, before all music. Stuff, music yeah. Happened. It just so happened to be that these niggas became them niggas. I just, I knew they was going to be them niggas, but they was my partners before that. Cool. I I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you 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 did a lot of videos for your niggas. Do you know, on one of my ca- captions, I put doing business with friends. That's what I because that's what it was. I that's what I put on there on a little yeah. running video. We were talking about the red. And I said doing business with friends because mm-hmm. this was a friend thing, and it finally you know it hidden hidden to me that, yeah. <laughs> that it was a friendship, and that's and that's cool. But somewhere so, it turned some business, bro. Business, it yeah. turned business, and you. I, I just feel like you you can't you gotta you got you got paperwork you gotta do it yeah you got to See, I know a, you don't be wanting it, to it be, you, you and Gucci the same way Gucci didn't want to do paperwork at first yeah. but you gotta do paperwork at some point at some point yeah at some point I don't, like these, to, I don't like to bring my artists in on paperwork because I don't like to because I'm not I don't I don't bring my artists in making no promises to them. I'm okay. telling them I'm gonna help. I'm you learning out. now. I'm learning now. See? I'm not making. I'm not telling. I had them. A lot of these niggas want me to I'm be their manager. I'm gonna blow you up in a year. Okay. Uh, what you telling? I'm just telling them I'm gonna help you out. I want to help you. Okay, but what if they blow before you? Why are you helping them? And that then once, leave? once we start going to them label meetings and before you sign with this label, then we'll sign a contract to secure our relationship. But I'm not trying to. Yeah, man. what if about they don't, uh, 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 what about Erica Banks? I'm gonna say I'm that. Saying. Yeah, yeah. Like you talking about, you just sound real good. This is what I'm saying though. If it's not in their heart to bring me with them, I don't want you to be with be them anyway. Yeah, but I don't, you just helped a lot of people, man, that you didn't get your credit for. I don't care, and you don't have no time. I don't care. I care, nigga. I'm over I here caring, care, nigga, because at the end of the day, I just don't feel like 
I feel like that's not the way it goes. I'm it don't pose mine, a goal like And when that. I get mine, for real, yeah. I'm going to get mine that's going to be with loyal people. If they leave me, yeah. Yeah, it is go. what it is. I don't care. I think that's what I kind of like Gucci said, but he did have ties with Migos when he, when he got locked up because he had to mm -hmm. give them over to P. No, no, know? no. That was uh. Gucci he had, said he had, he had ties to give them over Migos to, too, but yeah. it was Young Thug. Young Thug too. Yeah, but it was all of them that they talked about. He he ushered over to P yeah. like that. Yeah. So he evidently had some kind of ties if it wasn't but a agreement. You yeah. know what I he mean? He had ties with pretty much anybody that came out of that. Oh, of course, of course. But I'm just saying those were the ones that they mm -hmm. talked about when he got locked up that he was working with yeah. when he when he got locked yeah, up. Show that. So so I always think about him when I think about, you know, you and how you doing things, to be honest with yeah. you. Which is a good I'm gonna get mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm I believe so. It. I'm gonna get it with lower people, man. But you know that's what happened with Dre, if you really think about it. Dre went through the same kind of thing where he was getting money, but nothing like he was going to get like he got now. We talking but about if, Dr. Dre? Yes, sir. With who? I'm talking about when he first started out, he wasn't getting, you know, he was getting the money according to the movie. Oh, or whatever. yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, then yeah. he, he then Suge messed over him, and then he finally left everything, and then he mm -hmm. still got his. So I agree with what you're saying. Yeah. You're still going to get yours. I'm God got something for you. Can't nobody, hey, man, he more than the world against you. Go ahead, Steph. No, but going back to the question as if someone wanted to be a part of Top Off. What do you look for in an yeah, artist? Because I know that whenever you discovered Ciani, um, you were looking at her, you were looking at her, and I, um, from what I heard, you approached her, but what song she gave you didn't like that one at first. So you, when she dropped the next song, I think it was called... She got a Feelings note. Of she got a yes. note. Mm -hmm. Then that's when you reached out to her and said, "Hey, I want you to be a part of Top Off." Yeah. So what was it that Made she did you, on yeah. that song? I'm just using her as a reference for anybody who's listening. Who like, okay, I want to know what he's looking for. Well, honestly, I knew I wanted to sign Siani off of. She did. She did one little Instagram video. I'm talking about. It was like ten seconds. And she she probably said like two three bars on that hoe, and I was like, she got it. I knew she had it off that one little Instagram video. Then I hit her, I told her to send me some music. I was like, okay, that's cool. It got a, it, the auto tune a little right. heavy on it, but that motherfucker cool. It can I laid go. it off, and then she dropped a Feeling Evolved video. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, she got it for real. So that's when I hit her again and was like, I want to work with you. That's and she was with it. But that's I've been knowing Siani way before music also because both okay. of y'all are from fort worth yeah her brother is, is, her is big that, brother is that, actually like my best friend in high oh, school okay. so they got ties they got ties yeah, yeah. yeah everybody so you've have, been watching her yeah. for a long time and you need yeah it, I, i've been knowing her, it yeah. makes sense yeah so do you have other artists that you are watching at this oh it's moment a bunch of them oh yeah i'm always watching always i'm watching, watching everybody he got this thing he do on the instagram i seen the nigga on there i can't I, everybody on there trying to get their music on i don't know oh, what's the going reviews on. i'm gonna talk to you about that too <laughs> nigga I, I need to try to figure mine out i want to be able to do some reviews they ain't gonna be one for damn <laughs> so i hear them and i watch it a little bit i mean you really brutally honest what you need to be mm -hmm. you know what i mean and um but constructive criticism is always good yeah but these young niggas ain't ready for a lot of truth or hurt you first for it make you better oh yeah people be mad at me oh, for yeah. sure but i don't give a damn about nobody being mad if at you're me you're supposed to be mad if, if you suck you suck i'm gonna let you know you suck yeah, and everybody in comments man. gonna let you know you suck too it's a lot right? of man bro <laughs> ain't just me i ain't tripping did you ever pass on somebody and they came back and said, nigga y'all did it nigga without uh, you you said i was uh, trash nigga i got better somebody that tra that was trash and got better mm. and and they made it and, and you you could have helped them but you didn't mess with them no no okay I be careful because you, you own that thing pretty strong yeah. they coming through now i always see the potential yeah. i always you see the tell. potential even if it's even if it's trash at the moment i yeah. can, see can see potential in it through that okay. yeah if yeah. it's just completely trash though i know it's completely trash who, who do you who do you think is um not in your group because y'all don't like to say nobody but top off it's a bunch of them uh <laughs> but how many people it, are in top i off? think it's about 20 it's about 20 of us yeah i was close oh, okay. one i said i, think I mean it's, it's like 10 artists 22. but it's like really i don't he don't know it's too many it's a whole family of us it's a whole bunch some of people. men and he don't even realize they're in the little brothers and cousins <laughs> it's, all them niggas it is, it's a whole bunch of it's right, like a real I saw, I saw a group picture i think it was on your facebook it's the cover yeah. where it was like a whole that's everybody the whole had that's the whole family that's like yeah that. jt mama his all of sisters because that's they that's little the brothers. whole family i noticed that was at like a that's, it was that's, a graveyard or something like that who was that's jt yeah yeah 
Yeah. We That's do that powerful. twice a year. Yeah, I love yeah. I like Sometimes that. more than that, but we're going to go see JT twice a year for sure. That's wow. hot, man. And and it gives the other people that switch inspiration to know that yeah. y'all not just doing something. That's loyalty. This is real, man. That's loyalty. You know what I'm saying? I like that. I like that. See, now I didn't know that part. Yeah, mm-hmm. for sure. I didn't know y'all was out there like that. Oh, yeah. I'm That's nosy. Good. I look at look You up looked everything. it up. <laughs> they had it on Wikipedia. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> so, um, so the um when you came when you when you was uh starting out, it wasn't nothing but maybe some CDs. Uh I don't think you old enough for the cassette era. I don't know. Not when I not when I was not yeah, when I was CD, getting into yeah, the music CD, business. Yeah. It was CDs. Mm-hmm. And then it transferred over mm-hmm. to um to, to, to streaming and all that. How was that transformation for you? Man uh, you at, you seem pretty sharp on it. At now. the time at the time when that was when that was transforming I, that's like around the time I was first starting, and we had a manager at the time named Pook Urban South. He was uh, he he had the knowledge on all that stuff yeah. already going on, so it was it was it was it was brought to us pretty easily. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He knew yeah. what was going on with the streaming and everything, how to, how to get your music on iTunes and Spotify and all that. Are you working with those artists of yours? All twenty seventeen of them <laughs> <laughs> about YouTube? Are you working with them? What you mean? As far as are you showing them, hey, if you do this, this is where you got to be in order to do this. Are, are you are y'all working on every stream to make sure that these guys are set up properly? Oh yeah, they know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got their business because, right. But even if they, cause cause you know some people out here rugged and ragged. I oh, know, no. You know? Everybody so, got their so business right. So that's a serious part of it, right? Yeah, yeah for sure. Are you okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. You got any more questions, or you just holding this yeah. man up? No. Man got business, take care. Of. <laughs> yeah. So do you have any kids? Oh yeah, I got a daughter. I'm in a, a kid. Mm-hmm. No, he just an eight daughter. The boy look young. I got one. Just one. But they all start with girl. one. One, two, three, four. Yeah, <laughs> nigga, the number that go up girl. like top off, nigga. That is little. I got girl. one. How so many you want? There it is. He black. The, the rich in Fort Worth. The, the nigga from where you from? <laughs> stop six. Where you at over there? Eastwood. Eastwood. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. I hear a lot of stuff about Fort Worth. Just like they talk Fort Worth, about, man. I'm gonna be honest like, with you. Just like they talk about Oak Cliff or yeah, West Dallas. Yeah, it's like these areas are like the bad areas. No, they ain't bad. That's what I, I took you to the rodeo about. over there. Remember, you made me go no, ride them damn certain, horses over there. It's only parts, bad if you make it bad. Certain parts of Fort Worth, I be hearing about that. You know, there's be a lot of killings and there's a lot of stuff. I think anywhere can be bad. Jamaica, Kingston, hey, don't know, play. Lot, <laughs> yeah, know, come on now. I know, but there's certain parts of Kingston. Yeah. Yeah, that's, so that's anywhere. That's anywhere. But Fort yeah. Worth, go to Delaware but, and get wet. Fort Worth do be on the news a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so how is it like living over there? Oh, I don't live. You know, there. He oh, moved. He had to leave. Oh, oh, okay. Growing up over there. Oh, I, I, I stay. My, my parents got had me in the suburbs. That nigga looked like he had a little okay. money. Self, don't ask him. <laughs> <anything. laughs> no questions on the plot. I, nah, I, I don't come from money, but my oh, parents did. Oh right no, for nigga, y'all, y'all they wasn't hurting. The suburbs. I can tell oh, no, nigga, we wasn't hurting. You don't. You can tell the niggas just hurting. I oh, know. Yo, <laughs> you know the nah, one that come in there. That's what all. I'm saying. Yeah. So that's a good thing. Don't be ashamed of that. I'm not you. Ivy League and everything. My parents did their thing. Shit, I don't give a damn. Did you go to school or? Yeah. Uh, well, not college. Not college. Was, yeah, you didn't have to. Nah, hell no. Nah. See, the boy nah. talented. The boy like he like a like a LeBron or something. He just went straight to the. Program. I know I wasn't. <laughs> I knew I was never gonna go to college. You wouldn't. That was think, never in my plan. You so even, when you went to your parents and told them that you wanted to venture off into videography, as much as you started young, mm-hmm. what did they say about it? Were they with you or? I mean, they- at first, at first, when I wasn't really like making no money from it, my mama was always get, yeah, a, job, get, a, get job. a job, get a job, get a job. Of course, yeah, get a job. But it's always the. Mama. I'm like, I ain't going to work. I ain't getting no job. I got and then work. once I progressed a little bit, and things kind of got slow. I actually went and got a job. I went and got a job at Champs. I worked there. Nigga, for like I know. Two I weeks. seen you. I knew it. <laughs> I knew I seen that nigga at Champs. That nigga was not trying to get nobody no deal or nothing. I went He's standing there like this. <laughs> and I got my first paycheck there. How much was it? Don't lie to me, dog. Like one fifty. Woo, you were. And that's how that much I was like charging time. for videos at the time. I was like, I'm I got to work two out of weeks for one fifty. Yeah, I got to get out of here. Not, I quit. I never went back. Yeah, I gave a nigga a fifty eight cent raise one time. He quit on. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm serious. I get a nigga fee. He called. He said, "That all you giving?" I said, "Yeah, that's all they let me give three percent." And mm-hmm. nigga said, "I got to go, man." Never went back. Never, never went back. Never do it again. So so what what what's the what what's the next level? You so you gonna pop one of these? Or what, but what? How long does that take? You don't know how long that's gonna. You take. You never know how long it might take. So you it gotta keep doing months, videos. It could take five. Years. You got, oh, I, 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 
You you I'm masterful with them damn with them with them videos. Yeah, that's you. I'm ahead of the curve. I'm yeah. a I'm a I'm a stay in some money some type of way, but niggas, one of these artists gonna niggas, get about it. Niggas take pride in getting a video from you, bro. No, I'm that's serious, good. man. Like all the niggas, I, they be like, "Yeah, I'm gonna get one from Half Pint." Oh yeah, I did mine with Half Pint. Yeah, I call it I call it designer videos. <laughs> That's like that's like going to buy some Gucci clothes or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can go yeah. buy some Nike or you can go buy some Gucci. Yeah, yeah. I feel like my videos are Gucci videos. That's real. <laughs> what you think? Designer videos. I think so. I mean Niggas I, I, brag about getting a video from me. So do you ever work with any of the other videographers like the Jeff Adairs and all them guys? Or y'all I, all I started under Jeff Adair. Oh yeah? I started working with Jeff Adair. I when I was young, just now starting off, yeah. Jeff Adair brought me in. I was like uh, um what do you call it? Uh, um an intern, okay, for Jeff Adair. That's where I started at. And, and um, learn a lot. Yeah, I mean, I learned. I learned the basics. That's hot for sure. That's hot. Yeah. So, I do the you basics. need a, like my Ronin SC? Do you need a Ronin S? Do you need a a big one? Of the big ones look like a damn car coming at you. Oh no, I got everything. Is that that's how you come at them? I got everything. Damn, it looked real serious when they had them on the videos, though. <laughs> <laughs> So you got? I'm, I'm gonna let you go. I, I, you know, I be going in. I, I'm sorry. I freestyle. No, you go ahead. <laughs> I just be coming from here, baby. Yeah, go we having a real conversation. Yeah, that's yeah. how it's supposed to be. Mm-hmm. No, um, no, go ahead. Okay, well, I, I can I can just go in, you know. So, Ronnie, you did you did a lot of his videos, but some of them you didn't. Mm-hmm. Um, so, look, Ronnie is. I think that he should have been and blew up a long time ago. I think he do be getting that money, though. I know he do. The nigga looked like a little money when he came here. <laughs> now, the nigga looked like oh, he yeah. just already just, I'm like, damn, Lil Ronnie got a little money. Because I know yeah. a lot of celebrities. You know what I'm saying? And you can tell the ones who getting a little money. Yeah, Lil Ronnie going to get some money. He ain't hurting. He ain't hurting. Oh, no. I had to get to that, yeah, hey. that type hey. nigga. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lil Ronnie going to get some money. That damn Lil Ronnie, boy. Hey, and everybody around, everybody say, you know, he right. He He's a well-rounded artist. And, for him to come on my platform, for you to come on my platform, for Top Off to keep being so professional, that's why I keep pulling y'all on here. Y'all don't realize it, but each one of y'all, y'all ain't into no mess. He said that to me. Man. Mm-hmm. I'm pulling every one of them. That's why I want to deal with people who, when they do pop, I get to go with them because these niggas is real good people. That's yeah, what I'm looking exactly. at. Exactly. And the niggas in the mess don't come. I don't care. I'm, I just want the people who trying to bring the city together too. Mm-hmm. I'm not into all that stuff, man. Oh yeah, we I love I love the way no you guys bullshit. are doing it, man. Y'all yeah. y'all really killing the game when it come down to unity. Yeah, that's what this city needs, bro. Do y'all only deal with people just from Oak Cliff, or y'all got people out of Louisiana? Because y'all look like y'all rolling hard in Oak Cliff. Now nah, you talking about you talking about as far as our artists? Yeah, I know we from everywhere. I we seen got one from Louisiana from when Oak Cliff, Mike Fresh from Louisiana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I seen that when I started with he from Louisiana, and I and my boy Forward. from Waco, uh, uh, GT, uh, Gio, mm-hmm. Gio. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my boy. I just interviewed him the yeah, other day. Gio. I told you I'm pulling y'all. JB I, from uh, I'm gonna Arkansas. I'm getting Ciani. I'm get JB. I'm get all of them because mm-hmm. that's the way it go. And I tell Ronnie, I ain't buying no more mics. Y'all coming one at a damn time. <laughs> you know, these mics are almost five hundred a piece. Yeah, you're not getting oh, yeah. no more mics. We all gonna get in there. Yeah, but that's what it's all about. I, I think that's what's going to heal the city, people who trying to unify, not tear the city apart. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Then the, even all the the, the, the guys that, that did it, you know, that paved the way, they can come through. You know what I'm saying? People yeah. who really, really care about this city and who really, really put that work in, mm-hmm. like Don Chief, that was here earlier. I'm trying to pick the right ones, bro. Yeah. And Ronnie told me, he said, be very picky. Mm-hmm. I said that boy gave me some good info. <laughs> Just be very picky. That if you do that, you are gonna be all right. I yeah. said, appreciate it, Ron. Then I tell him that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what it's all about, man. Yeah. yeah it, Where it, do it, you get your inspiration from for your directorial? I get my inst- inspiration from the music, from whatever song it is that I'm directing. Mm-hmm. I really don't. I can't say it was one person or a director that inspired me to be a director or nothing like that because I never really cared like that. That's the crazy part. Like, it be cameraman that's like, like being a cameraman is like they passion. It was never really like my passion. I just did it because it fell into your it lap. Was, yeah, it, was, it fell into my lap and it was something to do. It was a good way to get into the music business. So I just did it. I never really cared like that. Where do you get your ideas from? 
from for you for the videos though no, some of them from do. The music. Yeah, some of the, the music it. and the artists, right? Yeah, for for the most part, I really don't come up with ideas for right. my videos. Yeah. I I let the artists do. If I got an idea for the your video, they normally come to you and tell you what they want. Exactly, and then you just put it together. Exactly. If I got an idea for your video, you gonna know because I'm gonna tell you this is what we need to do. If I don't got no idea, I'm not sitting there wasting my time trying to come up with an idea either. Okay, that's what I was wondering because. I know that a lot of artists that we've been having on here, they say that they put everything together. They tell you how they want it. But mm -hmm. you still want to put your stamp of, you know, of you mm -hmm. into the video. Yeah, when we get there, now when we get there, whatever you present me with, I'm going to make the best out of it for sure. But as far as coming up with it, I, it's, I do too much. I do too many videos, and I'll be giving everybody the same ideas. So. Sure. You work with a lot of people, so I mean, a lot of these artists that you work with, some of them you know they they ain't gonna make it. You know they ain't gonna make it. Of Don't course. try to lie to me, cause of I course. know you know they ain't gonna make it. You see the pro of you course. like, damn, I'm gonna do the video. You gotta let them try this though. This nigga is not gonna make it. <laughs> <laughs> but I put this Ronin on this nigga and this you gotta let big try. whatever. But uh, he gotta pay you. I'm gonna do it. Cause I done had people try to come on this damn platform and they ain't even got nothing to talk about. Yeah. I just want to come on there. I say for what? I had a nigga to call me out of these texts like, man, E, I see you got a podcast. I said, yeah. He said, I want to come on there. I said, for what? You have a hacker? <laughs> like, what are we going to talk about? I don't think we're going to figure nothing out. I said, you're going to freeze him. I had a nigga that thought he was a rapper froze up. You're going to ask a nigga one question. And, and that's it. <laughs> we done, nigga. Get up. <laughs> oh, for sure. No. So do you turn people down? Mm, I don't. I wouldn't call it turn them down. I just <laughs> don't respond to <laughs> sometimes. Reject the hell out of them silently. That's what he do. It, I, it's never been a time where somebody... Pay me a deposit or send me their song, nah, and I'll be that. like, "Oh yeah, after your money paid, we gonna do it. We I don't give do a damn. It. You could be dissing me in the song, and we gonna shoot See it. See that? <laughs> See that? That's what I'm talking about. I gotta do business with niggas like him. He what like me. About? Yeah, he trying to do some business with these niggas. Regardless, mm -hmm. that's what it take really. If you really a stomp down person, that's trying to make things happen for the city. Okay. So if I like to ask you, what is your top three artists of all time? Oh yeah, that's a, that's one of our good questions. Of all any, time, of all time, any genre. Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne? Of course. Uh, he from the South. I ride with you, baby. Let's go. Drake. Drake. He from Canada, but the nigga started in Houston. <laughs> <laughs> All time. Oh, that's you, this Ooh, your number tough. one? Oh, you went backwards? No, no, no. I went from one to okay. Wayne Drake. Everybody else don't matter. Huh? Three. Like, Damn, I don't know who to get. That's and tough. this in the genre though. though. This in the genre. Last, Do you listen to Sade or anything like that? You know. I, oh, I listen. I, I listen to music. I listen to music. So who you think it's country what music? Number three. Mm. Who you think? Yeah, I, I pick half pints. At number three. No, I let him. Oh no, that's tough. Twisted I tell black. You what, it ain't. Nope. <laughs> I'm just messing I with you. I fuck with man. black though. I love black. it. I, mean, I used to love his music. I yeah, black don't. That nigga wait till he get out. Is he coming home? Hell yeah. He coming home. When nigga, soon nigga. nigga, you from you, you he, from over there, nigga. Yeah, when I be talking to black all the time, so he, on the he phone. Be, yeah, but they, I, I, I did that when I was like, you just trying to get him nah, to, he at coming. the edge of the seat. You know what I'm talking about, nigga? I'm nah, coming out. <laughs> he coming. You think so? Within the within the next year and a half, two years, black gonna be home. Okay, okay. So that means he been going to see the parole board. Uh, he's been denied once. He may get F I one or F I two. We don't know yet. You know what I'm talking about? No, but the Black nigga coming home. He Y'all heard home. that first from Half Pint. Half Pint said it. Y'all hit the nigga up. He the one told me that. Black coming home. Black is coming to the house, baby. No, for and, sure. and and so number three. Number three. Number yeah, three. we gotta get that number three. I I just throw his name out there. I don't know. That is tough. Come on, bro. Give it up. That is tough. from Texas, nigga. Act right, uh -uh, nigga. Uh -uh. Don't okay, be, she don't, don't want me to do that. No job. <laughs> and I can tell you for sure, it's not no Texas artist Dang. that's what? in my top three. Dang. I can't deal with it's this not, dude, man. This is not. sad, bro. It's not no Pimp C. Watch out, bro. Don't you never cuss out of Pimp C. Don't do that. I love Pimp. I love See what I'm saying? It's not even the music. But it's not his top three. When it comes to Pimp C. Well, no, he over all that. Just so you know. Yeah, it's not Pimp C. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's because Pimp C really, he's too young to know. I'm, I'm old enough to know. He I'm, don't know. He don't know. I know a little bit of the music, but no. I like Pimp as a character. I like Pimp C as the person. Well, look, look let's just rapper. get out. Let's get out Pimp C. I like C him as this. a rapper too. Look here, let's not do this. I love look, the person. You messed this whole Pimp damn interview up. <laughs> behind, behind Pimp C. <laughs> I know I love Pimp. Okay, thank you. That's all I want to say, man. The brother, rest R.I.P. Man, get your rest, baby. Oh, oh, for sure. Man. 
Yes, sir. But I don't know. That third, that you gotta third give hard. us a third one, man, because this is one of my things that, that I categorize too, right? So give us your third one. Fuck it. The third one, Lil Ronnie Mother. I knew you were gonna you say that. Right. You got that right. You got that right. That's your nigga, baby. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, man. A good, that's the best choice. I was waiting. I was like, I know he's gonna say Lil Ronnie. Lil Ronnie, fuck it. Yeah, and and, and and rightfully so. He did work. He's wrote for people. The dude is talented. He he continues to be relevant throughout different phases. Mm -hmm. Give him his props. Yeah, We're well, giving him sure. his roses while here. And he's about to come back on the on the show because I got something I'm doing with him. Yeah. So yeah, I I'm gonna bless his game. Yeah. That's my guy right there. Yeah. I like I like him, yeah. I'm telling you. So, um, what 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 else you got for? Nothing, Nothing else. else. All right, man. You know what? Do you want to tell people how they can get a hold of you? That's for the people that everybody know you. But tell them how they can get a hold of like you. I'm kind of over that. I no, 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 no. Tell them how they can get a hold of you. How? How? We don't know. I don't even know. I try to get you. Matter of fact, you wouldn't follow me back. I said, damn it. I, 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 <laughs> I said, hey, no, 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 look. For nah, the past, bro, you don't like listen, to follow listen, me. Listen, you listen, think you all listen, that. For the the past, nigga wasn't following me for back. For the past month or two, my Instagram be tripping sometimes. It will you not let me follow you back. You know I'm what, bro? Let me see your phone, nigga. nigga. Let me see your phone, no, nigga. That nigga lying down on that nigga. I promise. We want him to follow Boss Talk Podcast 101. Man, and we need to follow him. ECEO. E underscore CEO. Right now in your face. I'm sick of it, man. Nigga got a bunch of followers. I'm sick of these niggas acting funny with me, man. Right now in your face. I'm a follow you back for I'm sure. Video. Cause I'm sick of it. I don't follow you. I ain't gonna lie to you. I said I ain't for the follow no nigga. He think he all that. You know a nigga get an attitude about that. Especially Bob's with the girl. Down. There it go. We're following. Now let me there see. There it is. It ain't that many of us. Okay, cool. As long as he followed it. And we ain't got but 200 followers. He 238. <laughs> <laughs> How many followers we got on there? Three hundred. I was the third. We just, I was we just, we three months in the game. We try and get this thing off the ground and have paint followers. So all, and he gonna shout us out. Y'all follow nobody our damn self. That's cause it's <laughs> us, man. Y'all follow nobody but y'all. On our personal page, we do. I followed you on my personal page. That's the one I was talking about. I wasn't oh, okay. trying to get you on there. Don't try to play me because I, what, I boss talk one on one. Now e underscore. underscore CEO underscore. I'm the CEO of uh. Just look at the three people that, they, that, that it follows. You can find it easy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And you can oh, unfollow you me when you're off air. I know how you do it, bro. And he'll uh -huh. follow you back that way. I don't yeah. unfollow nobody. You, you don't? Not at all. We okay. locked in. That's what I'm saying, man. And guess what? If you need me, I'm going to pull up. And For then sure. when I pull up, it ain't, I ain't broke. So you should be having a nigga <laughs> like me. <laughs> I'm going to no, pull up. Sure. My cousin say that when we go out. He's like, man, everybody else be begging when we go out. Man, me and you, we can go out together. <laughs> We had to pay, pay for everybody way to get in, the drinks, everything. Yeah. That's, that's cool, cuz. It's cool to have rich friends. Yeah. <laughs> but so, you know what the crazy thing is, like, before I started researching you, because I didn't, I'm not really into rap music, music. and, mm -hmm. rap and all of that. I love R&B. I'm yeah. an R&B girl. So do I. But whenever I started looking at your Instagrams and stuff like that, you are so hilarious to me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and, yeah he be cutting up. And, <laughs> for and, some reason, I thought you were fat, dog. I a did. lot of people be thinking that. I'm like, that. this nigga fat. I am fat. Really? Not really? Not. Not. I'm fat. No, you not fat. No, you're not. You a lot of people be thinking but I'm bigger than what I am. Be, that's half pint film. Oh, that's that fat dude over there. <laughs> <laughs> but you can dance. You can dance. Oh, he got even, big you face. had a brother look like you. Dancing. Yeah, my little brother, CP. Yeah, I'm like, that, is that they him? look alike? Yeah, they look alike. Yeah. I, look, I seen a nigga rap or something. I seen him. Now, he, he, he do films, too. He do films. That's what he do. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And you got another brother too that I supposed to be trying to get on for somebody told you him. You got, got another brother. Who? D Hawk? Yeah. 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 I heard yeah. about him too. How many too. brothers you got? Five like real brothers, I got real five. Brothers. Any sisters? Nope. Wow. Yeah. Five Daddy brothers. was a real step over there. <laughs> <laughs> five brothers. Yeah, that's what's you up, baby? man. No. I got C P under me and I got another brother named Torrance under me. So what I, what I want to do is we got to bring up and see on okay. so yeah hey man thank you so much for coming on the show man boss talk one oh one yes sir have paint. <laughs>